We are headed to Miami. The cutest dog in the whole world. Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another vlog. I literally had no plans to vlog today, but I just decided to pick up the camera and take you along on the next, I think I'll take you through the weekend. I am work from home today and I have tomorrow off because I'm actually headed to Miami tomorrow. Okay, yes, big boy. Um, I'm actually headed to Miami tomorrow for one of my great friend's bachelorette parties. I'm in the bridal party. So we are headed to Miami for the weekend for her bachelorette. I'm not gonna do a dedicated vlog for it just because, you know, it is her bachelorette party and I asked her if I could film a little bit and she said yes, but I don't want to, I wanna be present like while I'm there. I don't wanna be worried about vlogging, but I'm definitely gonna make sure I get some clips and throw some clips in here. I'm excited about some of the stuff we're doing. We're gonna, you know, do nice dinners. We're gonna like do a beach brunch, so. I'm excited to show you guys whatever footage I get, but I'm gonna take you with me today too. I am work from home today, and then that's pretty much it, work from home. Kind of started packing a little bit, but if you're new here, make sure you subscribe, join our little family that we have over here. I am a hybrid healthcare analyst, so I go in the office two days and I work from home three days. I have the cutest dog in the whole world. And I'm a grad student, so I'm getting my master's right now. I graduate in May, which is so close. Um, so yeah, just wanted to take you guys along the weekend. I'm gonna run and get back to work. I'm working on a data project right now, so it's very just mindless. So I'm kind of like watching vlogs while I do it, but so that is what I'm gonna get back to. like a little mini girl chat if it's loud my dishwasher is going and my dishwasher has no chill I mean it is like she's loud but I saw this recipe on TikTok and ever since I've been drinking it I have felt very like balanced and clean down there <laughs> I shouldn't put this on the internet but I am anyway 100% cranberry juice 100% pineapple juice and you do like this much cranberry this much pineapple and then you fill the rest up with water and it tastes really great and it's like a good, you know, like morning, people like orange juice and their juices and stuff. It's like the perfect little morning drink. It kind of gives me a little boost because there's some sugar and I highly suggest trying it. It's like makes me feel very balanced and clean and, and it tastes good. So like, why not? I know that's so random, but you know, I feel like why gatekeep these amazing secrets that I find on TikTok? <laughs> it is such a beautiful day out. It's like approaching 70 degrees, I think. So I'm going to, Take my lunch break to go on a nice walk. I don't know if I'll do an hour. I might go ahead and do an hour because I know the weather is so beautiful and I want to enjoy it. So uh, if you get a lunch break and you can leave the house, I highly suggest getting out of your apartment or house or whatever to get a little bit of exercise and like fresh air. Thought I could show you guys a little packing update for Miami. I leave tomorrow, my flight's at like two, but I have started packing, so I thought I could run through everything with you guys. Since it is a bachelorette, we do have like dress code kind of. So for two nights, we're doing black dresses. So I have this black one with these cute sleeves and then a sparkly black one and the bride will be in white, I'm assuming. Then I'm over here, I'm not really sure what I'll need this for, but I think it's nice to have a nice shirt and jeans outfit always. You never know when you might need that. Have a little casual biker shorts outfit, pajamas, bathing suits, sunglasses. Again, we're doing black and the bride will do white. Outfit for, we're doing like a beach brunch one day. So I think like some jean shorts and sandals, bringing my Polaroid. These are tattoos with the fiance's face on them that we can put on ourselves. It's only two nights, so I'm trying not to go too crazy. I feel like I have everything I need. Bras, underwear, have my shoes down here. This is my carry-on suitcase and then my carry-on backpack. I feel pretty good, my toiletries and stuff I have laid out. I'll have to use them in the morning, but 
I have them laid out in here. I think for the most part, I have everything put together. So I'm just trying not to stress out about it too much. I don't want to overpack because it's two nights. Like I'm, I'm not too worried about it. Hopefully all this stuff works out. I think I want to make a coffee. It's like almost five o'clock now, but I just, I don't really need the energy. Like I feel energetic. I just kind of want like a sweet treat. So I'm gonna make an oat milk latte to uh, finish off my work day. I'm in a great mood because I have PTO tomorrow and I fly to Miami. Like how could I not? Be in a great mood. Okay, my work day is over. I just took a shower to wash my pan off and put a hair mask in because I'm gonna shower after the gym. And I have on teeth whiteners. I'm gonna take these off in like 20 minutes, but I'm about to head to the gym. I'm gonna get in a leg workout. Literally Thursdays are like some of the only days I can go to the gym, but better than nothing. So I'm gonna head that way now. And then I guess I'll pick up with you guys later or tomorrow when we head to Miami. Good morning, everybody. We had a really great workout last night and then I had a paper due, so I literally just sat, grinded out my paper for a couple hours. And now I'm 100% free and we are headed to Miami for a very fun bachelorette party. I cannot wait. But, whole nother side note, Wayfair was having a really big sale on their rugs. So I got an outdoor rug for my porch because I've been wanting one. I just feel like I don't want to make it more homey out there. So we do it slowly and then hopefully it'll be good by the summer. But I got a rug. I think I want to get some lights, maybe some fake plants. Learned the hard way I cannot keep real plants alive. So let's open her up. I just completely guessed on the size. No measurements happened. So hopefully this will be at least big enough but not too big. I already can tell it's good quality, so that's nice. <laughs> I think this one literally might be the perfect size. Uh, I'm gonna go sweep my porch and then we'll lay it out and see how it looks. Okay, so it's one of those things where I definitely could have gone one size bigger, but like I'm okay with how it looks, so. This is how it looks out there. I'm happy with it, like it's a decent size. I guess the one size bigger would have just probably looked a little bit better, but imagine some like plants in the corners to take up more space and stuff. Maybe a bench over there, that could be cool. So I'm happy with it. So I just showered and got like, I'm just wearing leggings and a crop top and I'm gonna wear sneakers and throw a sweater over this for the airport. I wish I had some layers for the airport. I never know if I'm gonna be hot, cold, in between, you never know. Feels so good to have the day off work. And I'm not even stressed, I just feel like relaxed because I've had the whole morning. But it's time to pack up. So I'm gonna pack everything up and double check that I have everything I need. And I do use these cow packs to organize like my underwear and stuff. So I will link similar ones down below. one of my easier suitcase zips in my lifetime. I'm gonna do my carry-on, or that is a carry-on, I'm gonna do my personal item. Okay, I am completely packed for, except like chargers, cause I'm still using them. So my carry-on, my purse, ready to go. This bag is ready to go. The bride, Jessica, is picking me up in about 45 minutes, and then my boyfriend is gonna drive us to the airport. Um, she's picking me up, we're going to his house. It's a whole thing. I feel good, I'm coming back to a clean place, made bed, everything looks good. I don't land until like 1 a.m. on Sunday and then I work Monday morning. <laughs> I should have taken a half day Monday, but I didn't and whatever. So I'm gonna try and make my life as easy as possible for when I get back and I have to go into the office Monday morning. So I'm gonna go ahead and lay out my clothes for Monday morning for work as well as pack my lunch for Monday so that I can be somewhat put together and prepared so I don't have to stress too much at 2 a.m. on Sunday when I get home. She's on her way, so I'm going to get everything ready and I will see you in Miami. Skincare. Hello. Okay, we're in Miami. 
and we are getting ready to go to the club. We ate at Limoncello, lots of fun. This is the bridie. She has a YouTube channel. I'll link it down below. Fake news. This is Christina, she's in my Vegas vlog. Hi. No, you're wrong when you say you don't want to dance. That's not like you, yeah. Shock me up when you said to me, nice that you only like jazz and blues. It's gotta be smooth okay. for you, yeah, yeah. And you know that's right. Baby says she's chilling on the own of the vibe, and that's true, yeah, yeah. That's why I like you, check, check, yeah. And I gotta admit, find you a bad thing, made me wanna commit. See, I'm loving the way you be trying to play out to get. I tried to slide in your lane, you was not with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's a vibe, ain't it? See, now me, I like to dance, cause my soul feel it. See, you're trying to shake something, really move your hips. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Real smooth with it, smooth with it. Ooh, no, you're wrong when you say you don't wanna dance. That's not like you. It's me back from before my trip. I wanted to go ahead and end off this vlog because I don't know what kind of clips I got from Miami. Hopefully I was able to piece something together, but I love you guys so much. If you made it to the end, make sure you subscribe, join our little family that we have over here on the internet. And with that being said, I will see you all so very soon in my next video. Bye guys.